is a way to bring a little frivolous fun to your daily life. Hi, Sharks. My name is Brian Brunsing, and I'm from Buffalo, New York. I'm Max Brown, also from Buffalo, New York. We're seeking $250,000 for 10% of our company. Sharks, there are three well-known problems that need to be fixed when it comes to the 9 to 5 work life. One, it's too boring. <laughs> and two, with all the constant push notifications, emails, and text messages, establishing real human connection is almost impossible. And three, and this one's universal, there's just not enough fun in the world, and that's bananas. That's why we created Banana Phone! <laughs> banana Phone is a banana-shaped Bluetooth handset that connects to your smartphone so you can talk to your friends, family, or the IRS on a banana. We like to think of it as a phone with appeal. Baked into this delicious design is everything you need to spark real conversations. Once paired with your smartphone, this robust banana is ready to receive calls at the push of a button. Yellow? Or you can initiate calls by clicking the multi-function button twice and saying, call the banana man. Calling Mark Cuban. You can also show off your wild side by bumping your favorite tunes by using your banana phone as a speaker. And we banana split a portion of our proceeds with the Gorilla Conservation gearing up for gorillas. It's potassium with a purpose. What can we say? Talk more. Smile more. Save gorillas. And help us make talking cool again with... Banana, banana Phone! phone. <laughs> What did you guys do before you got into the bananas? I work for Visa, and this is a, a project that I've been investing tons of late nights, weekends, uh, in round-the-clock work So to this support. is a side hustle? This is a side hustle, correct. Got it. By day, I'm president of Garrett Leather. We're the world's largest Italian upholstery leather supplier. How long have you been in business? Uh, we've been in business for six years. <laughs> six years? Wow. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Do we have a banana phone in uh, here? You should certainly. You should check it out. Ah. It is six years old. Hit us with a little sale. Sure, so we've done over $1.6 million in lifetime what? sales. Yeah, $400,000 okay. in net income. What did you do last year? Last year, year was $540,000 in sales. Uh, net income last 12 months was $123,000. I, I gotta tell you, it's more than I, I thought. When was what the was aha th moment? You're in 2016, going, oh, I was sitting at my phone. desk with a banana in my hand trying to blow off a colleague saying I'm really busy, and I said, oh my God, this has to exist. <laughs> after a quick <laughs> Google search, no, there's after a, a quick Google Search, I realized that it didn't. And after a quick Instagram search, I realized that there were 45,000 other people who were making that joke at the same wow. time. And Smart there's a thinking. shark in this room who's made that joke as well. Oh, Barb. Oh, Barb. yeah, I use it all the Do time. Do you remember that, Barbara? But so that's tell us what it costs if I want to buy it online and what it costs you to land it. So this nanner costs $39.99 retail. Oh, that's a big banana. Our landed cost is $6 a unit. Do you have a patent? Uh, we did not pursue a design patent because what? they're notoriously Shocking. easy to copy and to knock off. So we pursued a trademark to protect our brand. But Max, just to be clear, it's not a phone. No, you need to pair correct. with it a pairs, phone. Pairs you just your... pair your banana oh, to your apple. Thank got you, it, Robert. Got it. Guys, let me ask you this. You did 540000 last year. Your total lifetime sales over six years were 1.2. What shifted to get your sales to go in the last two years, we've shifted to a robust direct-to-consumer advertising strategy, leveraging Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Google. It sounds very expensive. How much are you spending on that? We're spending $9 per customer. Is that your customer acquisition? It's $9? That's bucks? actually yeah. not bad. And what yeah. we are seeing is that we hit people with uh, targeted advertising for high-impulse conversions. And then when they get the phone, there's a virality to it because they're posting on social media. But nobody's full-time on this business. Correct. Not Are right you now. willing to give up your careers to support the banana? That's the question. If we have a strategic partner who's willing to work with us and leverage it, absolutely. Tell me what you're going to do with the $250,000. The next horizon for us is getting into brick-and-mortar retail. Uh, and so we have... Uh, I think that this thing screams to be in the Beyond section at Bed Bath & Beyond. Uh, Guys, you know, I think what you're trying to do in retail is beyond insane. I'm sorry it's not going to work. This is a very eclectic category. I do not need a banana phone in my portfolio. This is not a product for me. I'm out.
You guys took our fruit and turned it into money in your pocket. Giving you $250,000 means you've got to make $2.5 million in profits for me just to get my money back. It's a great personal business, but it's not a great fit for me. So for those reasons, I'm out. Thank you so much for your consideration, Mike. We really appreciate it. Congratulations. So many people have the idea, but nobody ever puts it into play. I'm just thinking of waking up one day and saying, I'm in the banana phone business. (laughs) And I'm not sure I see a scalable business for an investor. I'm out. Um, I'm not really an investor in kitschy, like, novelty products that much because I think that they have a a spike and then a a fall. It's not really the right product for me, so I'm sorry I'm out. You know, I just object to investing in your business for one reason only, which is I don't want you working on this part-time. One half and one half doesn't equal three, right? It will not grow if you do that. It doesn't make sense, so I'm out. Thank you for your consideration. Thank you, guys. Right. Good luck, Thank guys. You all. Yeah. Good Thank luck, you so guys. much. Thank you all. Bye. Who is that? Somebody calling because they just saw us on Shark Tank and uh, they want to place a massive order? Uh-huh. <laughs> hey, Kevin, guess what? I just invested in a banana. <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> Gorillas don't want this, believe me.